Hello and welcome back to Shotgun King. Um, I, apparently this series is going to be longer than I thought. Because I'm actually, I am enjoying this game. And, um, like, hard mode, it is hard. <laughs> but, um, or, or not, okay, good. It is hard, but, um, I almost saw a victory last episode. If only I hadn't uh, ruined it. As I usually do. This this was a novel ruining, however. Ugh, King can't be this is this is the card that ruined ruined it. Plus one ammo, plus one fire range, remove one bishop at six pounds. I like this one. I really like the subtle poison. Very, very good card. But that um night I think honestly, I think one of the things that's like really clever about this game is just about any uh card can be enough to win or lose given the right ex you know backup card you know like given the right synergy the enemy can have an insane advantage and um so can you and i think that's really cool um it is a little bit frustrating sometimes but you know you can't be you know Frustrated with the game so much. This is a situation that I don't like. I, I hate this. <laughs> wow. Like, we, we are so weak in the beginning in hard mode. Just because we have that reduced shot per round this would be nice remove one pawn add one knight less ammo plus one firepower for each empty slot i do like this cavalry cavalry is um what lost us the, the last round in combination with that other card we just won't take that other card that's it but extra firepower um for empty slots is nice it's gonna come in handy like right now We missed completely. Okay, four damage. Nice. We should, yeah, we should be able to win right there. All right. It's going okay. Oh, I love strafe, but extra firepower could be really nice right now. Oh, I really like strafe, though. I, I, sorry, I just have to go for the firepower. It, it's, strafe is so good, but, um, I don't know if it can make a difference, the same kind of difference that extra firepower can make. I need to get rid of that horse. to move there because we can use this get rid of that rook and then we're good to do whatever oh my god the knight back up i really should not take that anymore all right this is uh not great but we are hanging on just barely more firepower no, we can't do this. Remove one pod and one knight. Less ammo. Uh, our ammo situation is not good right now, I will say. I'm going to use this right away so that we can potentially just do a bunch of damage to the king, like, right away. That was good. That was also good. Um, this is unfortunate. 
but that's okay because we were in a good situation where we could continue firing with safety. Plus six ammo max. No, I don't like that. The moat is nice. A new pawn, uh, new pawn join the fight every four turns. That's okay. This is actually a great combo because I'm pretty sure that's gonna stop me, stop the pawns being a problem because they can't move past the moat. And more pawns means the enemies are, uh, the enemy is gonna be pretty choked. Again, that is, I think, uh, you know, it's it's a ideal situation for us. Let's get rid of those knights. They are a problem. Got rid of that queen. So let's see. Oh, they... What? I thought they couldn't move past it. Non-knight pieces can't cross the moat in one move. Oh, okay. It's not that they can't pass it. It's that they... Um, they can't do it in one turn. So it does limit the enemy. And, you know, that's fine. The pawns are exactly... They're the only pieces, actually, outside of, I guess, uh, knights that are completely unaffected by this. Bodyguard we cannot take. We just cannot do it. Um, so we'll have to take this. I'm, I'm totally okay with that because reduced fire arc is amazing. And we could use it because our, our ammo situation is honestly the worst problem we have going on right now. Really don't want to accidentally hit that pawn. Oh, I was would have been okay if not for the fact that that knight was there. We could possibly get a win like very soon. Imagine, imagine the knight, the the king dies, and it still counts as an instant death because the queen is behind the king. That would be brutal. Gain one ammo each time you kill a pawn. Love this. Um, this would be nice as well. Increase pawn, pawn speed. I don't like that. Add two bishops at the start of turn 20. Uh, uh, that's getting a little bit dicey. I think I think even though pawn speed is bad, um, I think I can deal with it. Because right now, pawn speed is working out for us. So now we can use this and we gain an extra turn and we also gain more damage. Um, that was a bit risky because it meant uh, if I had k accidentally killed those two pawns, it would have been real bad. That was amazing. This is going very well. There's the, there's the king death. Okay, we, we've got potential here. Plus one firepower. Oh, this is really good. We're going to get to ridiculous levels of firepower. We're at like Blitzkrieg level. I am going to do this. It's a bit riskier, but um, it's actually okay in some ways. Oh, look at that. They just kind of handed it to me on a silver platter. Love that. Love that. Oh, that was such a good win. I enjoyed that. I, I, I feel like I earned that a little bit. After all the, the crappy uh, accidental losses, your bullets pierce through the one target. We could stand to do this. Pawns plus one HP, remove one rook, add six pawns. Kind of love this. If we're piercing pawns, that means we're hitting like the best stuff right away. Oh my god, look at this. I mean... It's kind of nice. It's kind of nice, I kind of love it. I 
need to, I need more ammo. Maybe this isn't great. Hmm. I don't know if I, I think I'm in checkmate. I actually need more spread. If I had strafe, I could do this maybe. Okay, that was a really insane luck clutch. And I can't really move right now. Okay, so I'm gonna have to use this. And even if I do, I don't know what the next turn's gonna look like. Um, all right. This isn't ideal, but you know what? Let's get rid of some pawns. <sighs> yeah, this was uh this was a tough one. I think I can win though. Well, that knight was really clutch for the enemy. But we did it. Wow, that was really difficult. That was that was really close to being a loss there. Plus two fire range would be amazing. Um, add three pawns is fine. I think this is. I think that's that's the one right there. How many pawns are we talking here now? We're talking a full three rows, triple rows. Of pawns, baby. That is insane. But the the range, we can hit the king like almost right away. It's okay. We can we can yes we can win right there. Wow, this might be a hard mode win. All right, so we just have to fight the kill the boss. This might be very easy since we have the the piercing. What I should do is um, maybe use this right away so we have more firepower. Hmm. I don't know. I think it'd be better just to fire. We don't have enough ammo. That's gonna be the worst part for sure. 12, okay, we just need to hit him like one more time. Yes, we did it. Hard mode win. Hard mode win in the games that we're not even done yet. 13 minutes in. So it was the the wrath of the Black King finally carried him to victory. I don't we don't get like a, a special ending for beating it on hard, but that's okay. I would I would not expect something like that. So we're playing on very hard. Single barrel shotgun, no soul slot. No soul slot? Add one pawn one night? That is getting kind of ridiculous. <laughs> My god. All right. All right. I, uh, I, I think I hate it. But, um,. You know, maybe, maybe we can do it. I did just beat it on hard. Maybe I can beat it on very hard. It's already not great, I will say. Oh my god. We're gonna lose. 
I, I've I've lost on the first stage. No soul slot? I don't know. I don't know. Is very hard mode possible? I'm just gonna ask. I think definitely uh, a part of, you know, a major learning curve with this game is um, learning that you have to ignore what the game wants you to do at sometimes. Like, w even when it tells you you're about to lose, you sometimes you gotta you gotta make that shot. One damage. <sighs> I don't know. I don't know about hard, a very hard mode. I'm gonna say, I think that that's, uh, this is a little bit ridiculous. Remove one knight, add two bishops. Well, we have strafe. Reduce, remove one bishop, add six pawns. Well, this is a win, win, win. Win, 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 right there. Unless there wasn't a bishop. The, the knights are such a pain in the butt. For real. Please nerf knights. Interesting. Why didn't the rook move up? <sighs> wow. I don't know. I don't know, if we're gonna be removing soul slots, I feel like I need more ammo. I just kinda, I kinda feel like we need more ammo to justify that. Oh my god. Well, I made I made it to to floor three, so that's something. Remove two pawns, add one rook. Uh, no. Remove one knight, add two bishop. Also, no. Don't like either of these. Plus one ammo max is nice, I guess. Um, yeah, both of those were terrible. The, the, both both of those combos were like a hundred percent against our favor. I can't believe that didn't kill them. Wow. Uh, well, we, we survived somehow. I, wow. Wow. Some of this, some of this is a little bit spicy. I, uh, I don't know if I'm going to be beating this game on hard mode is all I'm saying. It's a little, little bit much. A little bit. I, I somehow am surviving though. So I, maybe I'm wrong. Maybe I'm wrong. Plus one firepower. Oh, firepower over reduced fire arc. <sighs> Guess I'll take the firepower. I don't know though. I could really use a soul slot is all I'm saying. I feel like a soul slot would uh, go a long way. If I go here, is there anywhere they can go? Oh, I can't go there though. What about here? Yeah, they can they can get me there. They can get me there. What about here? No. We also have strafing, by the way. So I can do fun stuff like that. Um, I ought to do stuff like that more often. There we go. So I, I guess I am winning. So 
can I can I really say the game is too hard if I'm winning? Plus two firepower. Oh, that's tempting. Destroying a rook gives two ammo. Add one rook. Also tempting. I, I cannot abide by queens can't die. But then also one extra additional. Yeah, no, I'm going to take this. We're going to lose, and it's going to be because I can't hit anything. But we do have firepower seven. So, hey. If I go here, is there anywhere they can go? That'll get me? Doesn't look like it. That, uh, this one pawn kind of scuppered them. And that's why strafing is so good. It's because it means that in a situation when you would not normally be able to kill something, you still can. As we'll just shoot him. I don't know why I'm, I need to strafe every time. Also, if you strafe, you can't reload in the same round. That would make it overpowered for sure. Add three pawns, 50% knockback. Add two pawns, or remove two pawns. No, remove one knight. I like this more. Ammo regeneration would be really nice. Plus one fire range, also very good. So we are kind of taking off a little bit. No, I, no, I didn't see it. I didn't see it. I didn't see it. Ah, no. <sighs> all right, all right, one, one more try, one more try. I was actually making progress there. It's really nasty in the beginning um, because you, you basically have like nothing. But it's not impossible. I wish it was impossible because then I could just say, it's impossible, but it's not impossible. All right. <laughs> Isn't that fun? I love that. I love missing and then getting checkmated on the next turn. Oh wait, no, never mind. Never mind. Listen. Missing missing my shots a hundred percent puts me right on edge. Missing like every single bullet. Oof. Extra fire range, extra regeneration. Um Yeah, I like this more than this. I think ammo regeneration is actually really good, especially considering we do not start with a lot of ammo. We just need to hit the king. Never mind. They just need to survive. Mission, survive. Um, well, this is a novel move. Oh. Uh, yep, yeah, that's not gonna be okay. Now, we do four damage. Okay, there's no way we can kill both of these things. Um, I think I'm in checkmate. Oh wait, no we're not, because I can shoot this rook. It'll it'll tell me not to, but I, I am gonna do it. I'm like some kind of chess rebel. There we go. 
All right, floor two, conquered. Plus two fire range would be really nice, but pikemen, I'll never want to take pikemen. Remove one knight, add three pawns. This is actually kind of a win. Even though pawns have extra speed, that's not okay. I'm not a, a huge fan of that, but the extra firing range. We're getting to kind of almost ridiculous range here. Are we? Yeah, one fire range. Oh, wait, never mind. That's reduce fire arc. Why did I think it was going to in increase our firing range? Well, this is good too, honestly. That's it. That was a good one. We were able to like hit that pawn and the king. This is a good one also. Pawns really in, like inhibiting like the 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 rook's movements. Well, that wasn't great. Not hugely excited about this. I think we're okay. Do I, st I don't have strafe anymore. We need to do some damage to the king. Okay, I can't believe we did it, but we did do it. Um, things are getting very spicy. Your bullets pierce. I really like this, but we don't really have the damage to make it work for us right now. 50% ch chance to knock back enemy. I don't like this. This isn't a great ability, but um, I don't think the other one's going to work for us. Like it would, It's a great ability if we have the firepower, but we don't have the firepower. Also, sacrificing range is not great. Ugh, the queen. Okay, this is a good... Never mind. I was going to say this is a good move, but nope. I think we're doomed. I really don't think there's any way out of this one. Wow. Okay, the knockback actually came in with a clutch there. I don't think... Okay, I think if I move here, there's nowhere where the queen can go. We can't kill the queen in one turn. We have to take... Oh, no, never mind. Never mind, I'm dumb. <sighs> Love two queens. Love it. That's my favorite. Oh, we're so screwed. Yo, we're so screwed, though. Oh, we can't even move. Oh, good. Third queen. Oh, I love that. That's amazing. Uh, We're doomed. Wait, I can't actually move. Um. Uh, yeah, can't do it. Can't, can't do it. Two queens. Heck you, queen. Well, that's what I, t that's what I get for taking increased pawn speed. Um, that's going to do it for this episode. Very hard mode is, in fact, very hard. Uh, I think I will continue with this series. I'd like to try and beat every mode. It might be a lofty goal at this point, but I mean, I'm making some progress, some headway. And then if I've done that, if um, there is still call for more of this series, then I think I will um, do endless mode and see what we can do, how far we can make it with that. I think that'll be interesting. Uh, if you enjoyed this episode, definitely hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. And I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy.